not today because you are one of those highly intelligent people that's gonna watch this video and you're gonna know which essentials to buy and where to cop them. First essential is the long sleeve polo sweater slash croquet Johnny collar sweater polo from Abercrombie. Now, depending on spring in your climate, it may be extremely hot or it may be kind of cool. And the great thing about these pieces is that you can buy one in a long sleeve version or you can get it in a short sleeve version. But the really amazing part about these items is the actual texture of them. Even getting these in a neutral color, which wouldn't typically stand out as a statement piece really does because of that interesting knit patterns. Both of these can easily be dressed up if you add a nice trouser and a belt, but you can totally dress these down too if you want to go for a more casual option. Second item is the croquet button through sweater polo also from Abercrombie. I'm not sponsored by them. I just really like their knitwear. <laughs> and as you can see, these are very similar to the last two items I mentioned, but this one is typically layered over top of a tank top. And I'd say it's definitely considered more of a casual option. That being said, it is my number one choice for a hot spring day or even a nice summer day. They come in a ridiculous amount of colors, so you and your friends should not be showing up in the exact same shirt. And the fact that it's croquet, once again, you have that really interesting texture clash. Number three, we have light jackets. Now I live in Canada, so having a light jacket in springtime is absolutely essential. Things like lightweight bomber jackets, denim jackets, varsities, overshirts, just the essentials that will never go out of style. Next up, we have the infamous flannel. And for some reason, women seem to think that this is like a superior style for men. They think that if they were a guy and they just wore flannel, they'd be instantly getting laid. <laughs> I don't know why, but that being said, said a flannel is still an essential. Now this flannel could be a flannel jacket like this one that I'm showing here from Zara, or it could just be a regular flannel like this one that I thrifted. You really don't need to spend a ton of money on these because quality wise, you're really gonna get the same quality of going from brand to brand. It's all the same. So don't feel the need to go expensive on a flannel. Now, our fifth item is linen pants. This is really as light as you can go when it comes to pants. Linen is the most breathable fabric you can find. So if your balls are typically swimming in an ocean by the end of the day, Linen pants are for you. <laughs> Linen pants come in all different colors, fits, and patterns. You can find some that have some stripes on it, or you could go for a smarter option like these, or you could even go for something that's a bit more relaxed fit if you wanna go for a breezier vibe. Zara, Banana Republic, Club Monaco, Gap, these places all sell linen pants. And number six is sneakers with a pop of color, because typically spring is a time that we start to incorporate more colors into our outfit once again. Some of my favorite sneakers are the New Balance 550s. I know a lot of people think that these shoes are dead for 2023. I don't believe so at all. I think this is gonna still carry on for all of 2023. And they got some really sick colorways. Another option that is extremely unique and not a lot of people have is the Axel Arigato Dice Low. However, they are on the more expensive side, but they got some really sick colorways. Of course, you got Air Force Ones, which come in copious amounts as well. And something that's gaining a lot of popularity recently is the Adidas Gazelles, which I'm not a huge fan of, but hey, lots of people like it. Next up, you need some relaxed fit button up shirts. This is going to give you that old money aesthetic, the Ralph Lauren vibe. Super easy to style these. And a lot of women I know think this is an extremely attractive style. You can style it done up with a pair of denim jeans and a sneaker, or you can open those buttons up, throw a tank top underneath, rock it with a pair of trousers for a more elevated look.